Staying in the city, what was once old is now new again. Fallen trees at the Edith J. Carrier Arboretum in Harrisonburg have been turned into a story walk for the entire community to enjoy. WHSV's Chelsea Church is showing us how this project all came together in this week's Tell Me Something Good. Harrisonburg's Urban Wood Program is all about finding new ways to use wood from trees that have reached the end of their life, whether it's wood chips, tables, or benches. So when staff at the Arboretum found several oak trees that needed to come down, they donated the logs to the city to be put to use. And after partnering with architectural design students at JMU, the Story Walk was created. 16 bookmarks now placed along a trail at the Arboretum, each post like a page in a book. Every month the Arboretum can change out the children's stories. And the first story I think for the first month that it's here is uh, the story of this studio, like what the students did. Throughout the last semester, architectural design students at JMU worked together to figure out how to make this project work using trees that had to come down. Uh, they were at the end of their life. And for safety reasons, um, JMU facility staff removed the oak trees out of the Arboretum. With this material of having a set amount of wood cut to certain dimensions, the students had a constraint. And what that constraint allows them to do is get creative. But they didn't have to figure it out all on their own. Students worked with the city and the Arboretum to get it right. This huge part of being about a designer is listening. Um, and then listening equals empathy for the material and for the place, down to some child they might not ever meet who's reading it. After reaching the 16th bookmark, those walking along the trail are invited to sit in the reading roost and read a story of their own, or from one of the two little free libraries built into the benches. Each structure crafted and made to last. And we studied Japanese joinery and the art of burning the wood, uh, which is called shoshugiban thousands of years in Japan they've been doing this, which allows the wood to become water resistant, pest resistant, and rot resistant. And now the wood that once stood tall overlooking the Arboretum is back home, but serving a new purpose. And this project is just very special because it's just a full circle type of project. We call it, you know, tree to table. If a tree comes down in your yard, Harrisonburg Public Works encourages you to give its urban wood program a call. They can help you find new ways to repurpose that material either for yourself or you never know. It could be part of the next community-based project. With this, tell me something good. I'm Chelsea Church.